So the previous video we uh, looked at how you can uh, add a uh, take profit and stop loss uh, bot. Now in this uh, video I'm going to see how we can set uh, martingale on our bot. So for creating a martingale we need to add uh, these uh, two blocks. So we shall have the stake and stake win and then we shall have that martingale uh, function here. So let's uh, go to variables the utilities then click on variables so we are going to set um, uh, stake win because uh, this uh, that stake if this bot is going to win and if it's going to lose so i'm going to create a stake win here and also we are going to create a martingale 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 yeah so it's very simple to create uh, these uh, these boards so this one is stake and stake uh, and so I'm going again to take uh, these. Uh, so for this one, I'm going to set uh, stake win, set uh, stake win to stake, set uh, stake win to stake, so that uh, if the bot uh, makes a win, is going to use uh, the stake as the stake win. But if uh, this bot is going to lose, we are going to implement the we are going to implement the martingale function here. So so you just take it here and put it there. Now, on the on the run ones, uh, on the restart uh, uh, trading uh, here where we inputted these else, we're going to add a logic here. So just add this logic. So I'll have to take this uh, trade again and put it here so that I can implement this uh, logic inside the else side so um, now here we are going to to also add another one here and another one here so the trade again is going to to the else uh, part now if the result is a win so I'm going to I'm going to add uh, I'm going to uh, utilities so that you can see these then on contract so this one is where it checks if the result is a win so if the result is a win then it need to set uh, the stake as a stake win so i'm going to so if result is a win then click on variable the same uh, let's set uh set a uh, stake to stake win set stake to again on variable I should input it here set stake to stake one uh, to stake win else if the result okay so else let's just uh, put else so it, it can represent uh, the it can represent the 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 um, it can represent uh, the loss so if the result is a win it's going to set the stake win to uh it's going to set a uh, stake to stake win sorry it's going to set stake as a stake win because it has a win but if the result is a loss then it's going to set a stake uh to be stake times martingale now uh, what you're going to add is a new variable called martingale i'm going to create a new variable called uh, martingale martingale so the uh, I click on create so we can uh, add this uh, block on the run ones uh, side so it's going to be martingale i'm going to call it martingale then i'm going to take uh, this uh, mm -hmm. so the martingale you can set it to two so let me uh, reduce this take to 0 0.5 all right so you can see here uh, if the result is a win then it's going to set uh, our stake as a stake win because it has uh, made a profit but else if uh, the result is a loss then it's going to set uh, so we're going to the variables again set a uh, stake uh, we're going to set our stake uh, set our stake to uh, 
So we're going to uh, mathematics because we, would, we need uh, the multiplication or arithmetic operations. So this, you're going to take this block. So it's, it's going to set our stake to stake times martingale. So I'm going to variables. I take this block of uh, uh, stake so they can put here. So it's going to set stake times uh, the martingale. So the multiplication sign is this one. So times variables martingale. All right, so let's uh, see if this uh, martingale function is working. All right, so you can see it has made a loss here. So it needs to multiply our our stake. You can see it has made a, it has multiplied our stake. After winning, it gets back to the normal stake. So if the if the it makes a loss, is going to multiply the stake with the martingale that you have set. So this is how you can say you can create a bot with a uh, take profit, stop loss, and martingale. On the next video, we're going to see how you can uh, add the entry uh, point uh, such as so that if the entry point is made, that is when this bot is going to take a trade. But this is how you can create a bot with uh, take profit, stop loss, and martingale. So you can see it's very simple to create a bot with uh, these uh, take profit, stop loss, and martingale just following up this uh, procedure.